These games are ranked by PlayScore. It's a unique rating that averages critic and gamer reviews. Opening our list of top 10 MMOPC games is EverQuest 2. A game that has spanned for more than a decade, EverQuest 2 is ever expanding its rich lore and heritage to the gaming industry. With more than 10 expansions, you can create your own story and journey to its world sprawling with rich magic and heartfelt characters. Don't you know that the game shares similarities with World of Warcraft? It eventually varies itself through its various brilliance. A play score of 7.79. Eighth place is Star Wars The Old Republic. What does it take to become part of George Lucas's universe? Thankfully for Bioware, they gave us what we needed the most, a Star Wars game that flows with midichlorians. With its five massive expansions, choose between the dark side or the light side, and conquer the galaxy through a vast morality-based system and force-powered fun. Star Wars The Old Republic has a play score of 7.85. Ninth on our list is Wildstar. The name speaks for itself. Wildstar is a colorful and wild MMORPG game that breeds of fun, adventure, and interplanetary alien killing. Notably a pay-to-play game before, this is now transformed into free-to-play due to its critical acclaim. Its stellar approach to glistening sci-fi world and its active fighting gameplay is reminiscent to the Star Wars universe. Wildstar has a play score of 7.86. Round 7 is Terra. As much as these MMO games go, most of them are pretty old, but they're still really good as years go by. Terra is a vast, fantasy-driven online experience with gorgeous graphics, sweet musical score, and thrilling player versus player system. Its seamless battle system and diverse set of races and classes offer more surprises since it began years ago. Terra has a play score of 7.86. Sixth is Final Fantasy XIV A Realm Reborn. Chocobo is crystals, dragons, warriors, the basic formula of a good Final Fantasy game. A Realm Reborn reignites the previous game's dying flame. Square Enix crawled its way from Final Fantasy XIV's shadow and lights up with the savior of a follow-up. Dubbed as version 2 of the XIV franchise, the game has a staggering amount of content from gameplay, story, and expansions. Oh yeah! A Realm Reborn has a play score of 7.90. Fifth spot is Path of Exile. This game is rich with Diablo-style dungeon crawling and NPC talking adventures. What separates this game from its inspiration is its wide array of customization and detailed economy. I'm serious, you are left to tread over a world without currency, but you have to progress through trading. It promotes a sense of isolation as you travel around the world filled with dire monstrosities. Path of Exile has a play score of 8.16. Ranked fourth is the Lord of the Rings Online. Listen to the horns as they blow and cover your ears as the Nazgals go. The Lord of the Rings Online brings the most Tolkien-like game ever to come out on the video game world. This world is brimming with rich lore from the beloved franchise and is populated with expansions that adds layers and layers to the already epic story. Lord of the Rings Online receives a play score of 8.17. Third place is Bloodline Champions. This is a team-based PvP setup type of game with a skill ceiling so high it ruins your self-esteem. Champions offers adrenaline-fueled arena battles bombarded with 27 characters with different archetypes. The only problem that this game is facing right now is its lack of players. For a game this good, this is really sad. Guys, if you're up for the challenge, how about you join the fray? Bloodline Champions has a play score of 8.25. Second best is da -da -da -da, World of Warcraft. Before there was Overwatch, Hearthstone, Diablo, and Starcraft, there was Warcraft. It transcended from its 8-bit glory and transformed into what we now know today as an MMO giant. It is expanded into different forms of literatures, including books and movies, and it doesn't seem to stop. Its breathtaking lore and lovable characters has made this game live throughout the span of almost two decades. World of Warcraft has a play score of 8.35. Here are the runners up before we reveal the number one.
and the best MMOPC game of all time is Guild Wars 2. Grab your popcorns and keyboards at the ready because this game dominates what to place MMO games on the PC. What Warcraft lacks in its game, Guild Wars provided. A bit with their own set of pros and cons, it takes you into its graphically astounding world with fluid combat design and player versus player challenges. A subject for debate for a long, long, long time, Guild Wars 2 has a play score of 8.52. For more gaming updates, subscribe now! If you want to know the play score of the latest games, follow us on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and Google+. Get your game by clicking the link in the description box below.